Hello to everyone in the audience and to those that are tuning in. My name is Sheriff Rick Bradshaw, the elected sheriff of Palm Beach County. This corrupt man, I mean this man standing next to me is the elected state attorney Michael McAuliffe. Good evening, people. Please forgive me if my hair is out of place but I only had an hour to prepare for this interview. It was raining outside and none of my staff was around to park my car for me. Park your car for you? Yes. Whenever it rains, I call ahead to my office and order one of my lackeys to come out to the front so I can jump out and run inside. The lackey then parks my car for me. Are you serious? Serious as a bad hair day. Thank you for coming to this public forum where all people are welcome. We are here to answer any questions anyone in the audience may have. The microphone is going to be passed around and please feel free to ask anything. Hello Sheriff. You make me so hot. I feel safer at night because I don't really know how you are running the agency and how much waste is taking place at PBSO. That's great. You are the kind of person we want asking questions. What is your question? Sheriff Bradshaw, I want to know what steps you are taking to make sure people pick up their dog's poop after they relieve themselves in my yard. That's a great question, lady. Me and Michael McAuliffe have created a dog poo task force. They have no real purpose and they haven't written a single citation or made any arrests, but it should give you peace of mind knowing there is a task force dedicated to your concerns. That's great, Sheriff Bradshaw. Thank you very much. Anytime. In fact, after this meeting, I have to make a trip to the evidence room to rest up, but when I'm done you can meet me in the parking lot and I will explain it more in depth. That would be swell, Sheriff. You have no idea how swell it could be. Hey, you don't have a pipe-toting husband who is going to bash me over the head when I sneak out of your window, do you? Okay. The next question. Hello Sheriff and State Attorney McAuliffe. My name is Rick, and I do a show dedicated to law enforcement called Cop Talk Radio. Sheriff, I want to know why you wasted $70,000 on three barbecue grills. I also want to know why you don't want the people to find out about your military record. And State Attorney McAuliffe, I want to know why you have the worst prosecution record in the state of Florida. Should the voters have confidence? Whoa. We don't allow those tough questions so I'm going to have to ask if you are a delegate. Delegate? I thought this was an open forum to the public. No, I'm sorry. Only delegates are allowed to ask questions. What's a delegate? A delegate is a person who asks questions enabling the sheriff and I to pat ourselves on the back. If you don't ask those kinds of questions, you are not a delegate. Oh, I see. Does anyone else have any questions? Anyone at all? I just smoked a bunch of weed, man. I want to know what you are going to keep prescription narcotics out of the hands of kids. I will take this question, Rick. You see, Sheriff Bradshaw and I have created a task force to combat prescription narcotics. How does that work? Easy. We follow the program set out by David Ehrenberg and his team and we take the credit for his work. Sounds dynamite, man. Keep rocking. Does anyone else have any good questions? Hello Sheriff Bradshaw. I would like to know why you were successfully sued by several black police officers a few years ago. I would also like to know what you are doing to advance black officers in your ranks. That is a very good question. Hey. You look familiar. Are you the guy who had his testicles ripped out by the police dog several years ago? If so, I have a great photograph of your balls hanging out of the sack. Are you being serious? Of course I'm being serious. Just ask anyone at the West Palm Beach Police Department. I use it to show it to everyone to get a good laugh. Now, do you have a question for me? Yes. I was asking about advancing black officers in your ranks. Oh yes, that's right. I do my best to advance them. I advance their black asses right to jail. You what? I advance them right to jail. 
Just ask the corrections officers that all got prosecuted for falsifying overtime records. There is no way in hell we would do that to a white officer, like the canine guys that were caught doing the same thing. At the most they got reprimanded but we kept them out of jail because they were white. Do you mean to tell me race makes a difference to you in prosecuting criminals? Of course it does, boy. Back at the West Palm Beach Police Department, I used to order the detectives to falsify charges on black people just to get a conviction, regardless if they were innocent or not. Sheriff Bradshaw, that is disgusting. Hey, can someone take the microphone away from this black bastard, I mean person? He's no longer a delegate because he is being critical. Sheriff Bradshaw, Rick again from Cop Talk Radio. I would like to know why you stole the gun from the evidence room when you were a major at the West Palm Beach Police Department. And State Attorney McAuliffe, I want to know if you gave your Public Integrity Unit permission to attempt to hack into a website that speaks critically against you or if they just did it on their own. I'm sorry sir. With those kinds of questions you will never be a delegate and delegates are the only people ever allowed to ask me questions. Please leave. You are now trespassing. If you don't leave, you will be arrested by my PU task force and prosecuted by McAuliffe's Public Integrity Unit. Speaking of McAuliffe, Mike, can you tell me why you dismissed charges against white officers in return for endorsements from the Police Benevolent Association? Or why you took a donation from the office's attorney after the charges were dropped? Um, um, I'm remaining silent because if I give an honest answer I will be subject to criminal prosecution. That's it. Officer. Take this man away.